Watching wheels rolling heavy through the desert night I've been driving all day but I won't shut her down tonight Good morning guys, good morning Actually, to, to be honest, it ain't morning It's noon I took a nice little break we're in Twin Falls. We're at the uh, Flying J here. Gonna go in, get a shower. Then we're gonna go over to the Blue Beacon. We're going to get our trailer washed out. I'm gonna get my truck washed. Then we're gonna come around here and get some uh, reefer fuel. Then we're seven miles to my pickup. A drop and hook over there we'll go over there and pick up our wagon and head out toward illinois wilmington illinois Proceed to shower three. Shower three. Shower three. Oh, okay. It's in here. Shower three is this one right here. Forty four oh six four three. Oh, come on now. That grant four zero six four three. About to get mad here. Four zero six four three. Man, it don't make a buzzing sound. You gotta rock the door to get it open. Yeah. Yo, we're gonna get us a shower. We'll see you when we get right back. We got our shower. Let's get out of here now. Go back to the truck. I don't need nothing in the store. So we're just gonna go straight to our truck. Alright, let's go to the blue beacon. We'll just drive through here to our pickup and then do our drop and hook. Well, actually, 
to be honest, we're only 2.6 miles. Oh no, 5.1 mile to our pickup. So. Turn left on Kimberly Road. We'll show, we'll show a little more than this. This ain't much to show you. 2.4 mile, I gotta make a left turn though. Kimberly Road, US, US 30. Tankers right. Okay. Alright guys, we'll be right back. Don't go nowhere. You're not gonna believe this. I gotta go. I'm not going to the flying J though. I'm going to a different truck stop, but I gotta go buy me two Molochs before they'll allow me to drop this. In other words, I gotta go buy two brand new Molochs, put them inside my trailer, and come back. to spend some money. Take out only. Pretty good sized truck stop here. I need low bars. I need low bars. Two. I can bring up over here though. Do I need to carry them over? No? Good. Man, I smell food too. God darn it. it smells good. There's lots of it. 
shoot. Can I uh, pay for these low bars and maybe grab something? Yeah. Up on the way out? Yeah, here, let me give you your receipt, but I know you paid for them, so you're good. All right, thank you. You're welcome. Let's grab us a, they got taco time here. Let's, let's grab us a, maybe a burrito or something. Take it with us. They got chicken over there or burrito? Well, we have a soft taco that's just beef, cheese, lettuce, and tomato. That sounds good. Let's do that. I just want the, I don't want the whole meal. You just want the burrito? Anything else? Just nope. one? Just one. If that's everything, that'll be 317. Okay. You got it. I think that's me. Thank there you, ma'am. You, have a good night. you bet. Thank you. I was in their lodge and I'm not holding the fuel island up. It's still empty. Taco time. Has anybody ever heard of taco time? Well, I'm going to eat this on my way there. I'll see you when we get back over there. We're back. They got two brand new low bars back there. So I was able to shut the reefer off, park it, and then our loaded trailer should be over across from the office. Trailer number 153037. It's 
an old trailer. In 300 feet, make a new turn if possible. There it is, 307. Okay, oh, no, 037. Five, one, five, three, one, five, three, zero, three, seven. No, that's not it. He did too. They see that? Maybe because he did? No. This guy's clearly in his hole. But look what this prime driver did. He parked past that yellow line. I don't know. I thought prime taught their guys better than that. I do care about being a professional, so I would never, ever drop a trailer and make it look bad. Uh-uh. Didn't they want to go in. What we're going to do is before we back into this trailer, I'm going to check the seal on it to make sure it is the same trailer then i'll have to go in and let them know it's the wrong trailer number there it is right there one five three three oh seven let's like i said let's we're, we, we're not gonna back into it but Check the seal. Let's go check the seal number. Okay. I'm gonna check the seal, make sure it is. Seal number zero zero. It is. Seal's good. Right seal. Yep. All right. They just got the the th uh, it should be three oh seven yep. instead of zero three right. seven. So should I'll, I go in? Yeah. Okay. I'll let her know you're gonna head in there to change the paperwork and then you should be good to go. All right, guys. I'll be right back. We got that all straight. She only crossed it out and rolled it in there, but only her can do that. I can't. Now we're hooked. All right. Let's uh. <laughs> Let's hook our lines up.
Let's go to the garden. Make sure everything is right. Yeah, okay. I just did a tug test. It was going to come apart. It would have been. Let's head to Wilmington, Illinois. Put on our seatbelt. 